Hey, what's up everybody? It's the Hyphenate here and today I'm going to show you guys a quick and easy way on how to adjust your stereo audio tracks in DaVinci Resolve. This is going to allow you to take a stereo track which has both left and right signals and with the press of a button, choose if you want only the left channel, only the right channel, if you want to combine them to make them mono, if you want to flip the left and right channels, or even if you want to adjust the volume of each individual channel for the whole track. It's really simple. Let's first go to the edit page. So here I have a wedding that I shot and the audio here for this video clip is the audio taken directly from the camera, which is stereo. Now the PA system, the speakers that were used for the microphones were placed on the right hand side. There were no speakers on the left side. So the only audio that I care about is whatever was coming out of the speakers, which again was only on the right side. So I want to get rid of the channel on the left and make the right audio channel both left and right. Now this method I'm gonna show you guys is going to take all the audio on a whole track. So if you wanna alter the sound on multiple tracks, you have to do it individually. And to clarify, this method is not for changing the audio on individual clips. This is for all clips on a single track. So here we're gonna go ahead and adjust the audio one track. Let's go ahead and go to the Fairlight tab. So here I have audio one. You're gonna go to your effects. Now, if you don't have your effects selected, click the button here at the top and it'll show up. We're gonna go to the native plugins here, the Fairlight FX plugins, scroll down, and we're gonna choose Stereo Fixer. Go ahead and click and drag that onto an effects slot here on your channel. Now here you're gonna see your plugin. Now again, this is a stereo track. And as you can see here on the clip, the left channel, which is at the top, has less sound than the right channel. This is louder because this is where these speakers are positioned. Now here you have some very simple buttons. Under format, you can leave it at stereo, which has a left channel and a right channel. If you wanted to combine these two audio signals and have them both be on the left and the right channels, you can actually go ahead and click here where it says mono. And now when you press play, both of these will be combined. If you wanted to switch the left and the right channels, you can go ahead and click on here, reverse stereo. And now the right channel is actually gonna play out of the left channel and the left channel is gonna play out of the right channel. If you want it only the left channel, then we click here to where it says left only. If you want it only the right channel, click on where it says right only. And then you even have the option for mid side, which I pretty much almost never use. So for the example that I was talking about earlier on this wedding video, the only audio that I really want to focus on is the right channel. I would go ahead and click on right only. So if I go ahead and press play, husband and wife, you make this your beautiful wife. So here, if you paid attention, having the right only selected means that only the right channel is going to play on both left and right. So this actually makes it mono, but just the right audio channel. Same thing with the left. Now, the great thing about choosing left only or right only is that it's actually going to make it a mono signal, meaning if you select left only, it's going to play the left audio on both the left and right channels. The right only is going to play on left and right channels. Now, let's say you wanted to keep it at stereo. Here on this plugin, you can also change the gain, the volume of each channel individually. So let's say here the right channel is just a little too hot and I still wanted to keep whatever was originally on the left, but I just want to lower the right. All I got to do is bring down the right signal and now only the volume on the right channel is going to be affected. This stereo fixer plugin is incredible and extremely useful in so many different scenarios. Now, let me give you guys one more example that you can use this in. Let's say you used a dual lav mic system or a stereo audio recorder with two different inputs and you have two channels that you want to separate. Let's say you had one mic hooked up to the left channel and one mic to the right channel. Once you've done all your cuts and your edits for the video and the audio, then you'd want to separate the channels. Let's go ahead and remove this plugin for now. We're gonna right click and add track, choose stereo, select all the audio that's on that track, and you can duplicate that by holding down command on a Mac or alt on a PC, and then drag the audio down to the new track to duplicate. Now we're gonna go to audio one, get the stereo fixer, put that on there. Go ahead and choose the left only option, close that, get the stereo fixer plugin and add that to the second track, and then there, choose right only. And now everything on the first track is gonna be the left channel only on both the left and right channels. And then everything on the second audio track is gonna play the right channel on both the left and right channels. This way now you have full control over two different audio sources. So there you guys have it. That's how simple it is to use the Stereo Fixer plugin. Hopefully this video helped you. If it did, please drop a like on this video, drop a comment below if you have any other questions and please make sure to subscribe. I have a lot more videos coming soon. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.